pickle. So, I'm excited. Buttermilk pie. It seems interesting. This one now. Would get the slider, which I heard is very good. The peach cobbler churro. All right. Today I decided to wear these ears because nothing else really matches my duck defender merch. So, oh, I'll just wear it. So I did crop this myself. It is not naturally cropped, but I cropped it myself. <laughs> I feel like Mantis from Guardians of the Galaxy. Like they have antennas or something with these. They're cool or whatever. I totally forgot my Oswald ears, dude. I took them off because I was like, there's no way I'm going to drive like that. That's such a distraction. I'm already riding dirty. You know, I got too dark of tint. I don't got a front license plate. Can't be driving around with them Oswald ears. And I was saying because I used to have a tinted front windshield and it cracked and then I didn't, you know, tint the front windshield again so they can see me. How can they see me? So now I don't have ears on. It's alright. I'm going to buy some headgear today. Alright, I got my sip and saber patch. Yeah. It's counting and bringing up for the both of us. So I got one, two, three, four. Tell me that you love me more. Tanto tiempo disfrutamos de este amor. Let's go hit it. Oh, they do not sell these here. I just received this gift from Xavier. Thank you so much, Xavier. Woo! I'm gonna have them cut the tag off, though. Oh yeah, baby, oh yeah. So I asked them if I could cut the tag off, and they wouldn't do it. They said they can't cut the tag off, so they gave me tape. So the tag is on. It's kind of ruining my swag a little bit. Okay, the first thing I'm gonna get is here Cubano slider. Cubano. Cubano. Here, okay, I gotta order it. Where do I order it? Oh, gotta order it over there. This is just like the DMV. Okay, so the Cubano slider is slow roasted mustard crusted pork. Ah, not a fan of pork. And sliced ham with melted Swiss cheese and pickle served on a Hawaiian roll. I really don't like pork, but I probably will like this. So I got the uh, blueberry buttermilk pie. I almost got the cheesecake, but I don't know. I was intrigued by the buttermilk pie. Right, I got the two items, the Cubano and the... I already forgot what this is. Can I come to your house? There's a lot going on around here. There's a lot going on. Yeah. Okay. Not flexing the new ears. I, I don't know who's talking around me, alright? Okay. Oh, flip. This table's so wobbly. Okay, here's my Cubano slider. Okay, I heard that it has a thick pickle. It does have a thick pickle. So, I'm excited. I got nothing but pickle on that bite. That was good. Mm. Whoa. It's very salty. I'm gonna give it a 7 out of 10. And it was, it's weird because like the bread's kind of warm but the meat's kind of cold and I'm not liking the, the temperature variation. I'm still gonna finish it though. Here's the what, buttermilk pie. Buttermilk pie. It seems interesting. It's good, but I kind of wish I would have went with the cheesecake. I think the cheesecake would have smacked harder. This is like... Today she's trying to put on, put on some junk in the trunk. I finished this. I'm about to go to nuts. Nuts about cheese. I got the petite burrata and the Mickey Mouse shaped macaron. All right, so here's the next two: petite burrata and that one. Everybody's kind of 
talking about. I did a review this four years ago. I have no idea what it tastes like. I forgot, totally forgot. So I'm not a huge chocolate person, but a lot of people like it. So I'm gonna have to cut this really weird because they're playing Malibu in the background. So next time when Chris is here, I'm trying that one. I have the carbonara garlic mac and the grilled top sirloin in my last uh, time that I was here with Krista and the guava lychee mule and all that stuff was pretty good. I only have two tabs left for today. I have more at home, but I don't want to use them on vegan food for now. Sorry guys, but maybe maybe next time I'll try that stuff. The IPA sausage dog is very salty, so I'm gonna pass on that one too. Still looking for wings. I'm carrying around this macaron because if I see one of my friends here, I want to give it to them. I feel bad about throwing it away, but I don't want it. It's too indulgent for me. But, um, yeah, I'm getting a lot done in a very short amount of time being here by myself. Uh, it's pretty cool. Like, very focused on getting the next items right now. I found the wings. Gonna get the wings. I don't think I'm gonna get... I guess I heard the barbecue beef brisket slider was good, so maybe I'll get that too. They were out of the wings, unfortunately, but I was able to get the slider, which I heard is very good, so, I mean, that's good. You guys, for some reason this clip won't import, so I have to do it like this. This is really good. This is the Cubano. Pretty good slider. Yeah, it's only 9 out of 10. That one, I pretty much finished. I dropped that piece of meat, so I don't want to eat it. Remembered, there's a true I want to try part of this, and I'm gonna go grab it with my last tab. It looks really good. I heard it's amazing. Waited the true, I had to get the chile relleno empanada. Ooh. That's the chile relleno empanada. I heard this one was good, so it better be good. Oh, yeah, that one's good. Mm. Oh man. Oh, it's a little spicy too. It's like a seven out of ten spicy. Maybe a six and a half for me, but like someone who's not spice tolerant, you might not like this. But if you like cheese, you'll like. Oh, this is gonna be a ten out of ten for me. This is the best one I've had so far. Mhm. Mm Paloma, Paloma Negra. Is that a real song? I don't know. It tastes like a pineapple vodka. Try it. Not too sweet. Honestly, that thing was so spicy, I can't tell if this is strong or not. I like it. It reminds me of a Mexican, Mexican mule. Eight out of ten. Hey, this is the thing we've been waiting for, the peach cobbler churro. Peach churro. Alright, check this out. The peach cobbler churro. And it's not part of the sip and savor, unfortunately, but it looks bomb. I'm supposed to get a peach on there though. This isn't a spoon. I should have got a spoon. All right, I'm gonna get. I better not drop none of this. I'm gonna be really sad if I drop this. Dreaming about these ears. 
dreaming of you tonight till tomorrow. Should I get them? They're expensive though for these ears. Normally they're like 35 bucks and these ones are like 59 bucks or something. Alright guys, I'm going live now. So this is the prequel to the live but the actual sequel to the live because you already saw the live but I did a vlog first before I went live. What do you think about that? Let me know in the comments. But thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you next time and Akuda Matata. It's a what a wonderful phrase. I gotta put these back on now. Imagine I leave these here. Oh my gosh. Wow. Wow. So now the vlog is over and the live stream is beginning in Disneyland so um, hope you're checking out both. Alright guys we're in the all new and improved Toontown. Look at that cute little fountain. Nobody puts baby in a corner. I'm vlogging. So I am checking this out, this Toontown out on the live part two. So if you want to check out Toontown in depth, check out the live part two. But I just want to show you that I'm here at Toontown as well. You know, I couldn't miss out on this. It's nighttime, so we're just going to do a little walk around. Oh, whoa! Is that a barb? Is that? Is that a barb? Is that a Is that a barb? How many devices are there? So many. Inception. Device inception. Hello. Hi. How are you? I'm good. Okay, I'm gonna dig goodbye. Okay, Vic and I are getting on the Toontown coaster. I have not been on this in a mucho, mucho long time. Woo! Shortest ride of all time. I blinked and it was over. We're gonna go on Mickey and Minnie's Runaway again.